G'day there everyone, Daniel Anderson here. Now there's some really nice features rolling out to SharePoint Online. In a previous video, we showcased how we can now upload our custom images for our section backgrounds. And now what we're going to have a look at is the image web part and how we can change the shape of our images directly from the web part itself. So just a little bit of a recap here. We've got our section here and you can see in the properties of our section, we now have the ability not only with our uh, gradients, but we can change our background and upload our uh, custom background images. We can also change the fill mode uh, and also the overlay um, color and also the direction of that overlay and the opacity of the overlay as well. Now what we're gonna do is I'm gonna add from the templates, I'm gonna add a three column layout with the image web part. And we're going to add an image to each of these uh, image web parts. So just for simplicity, I'm going to just use the same image in each uh, web part here. And you can see default square images, but what we can notice here, we've now got this shape drop down box or drop down menu where I can change the layout or the, the shape of our image. So I've now got a teardrop, I've got a hexagon, and now what we might do is a circle. So and rather than having just boring old bland square images, we can now customize and change the shape of our images in combination with section backgrounds. We've now got some really nice features to build out some amazing uh, engaging pages that are going to um, make your users want to come back and look uh, look at the content and consume more and become engaged on your SharePoint sites. So I hope that brings you some value today. Image shapes now available and part of the image web part as well as uploading your custom images to the to your section backgrounds.